An animation channel has just recently been hacked, or at least that's what most of us think. Some think that the channel was actually bought. So the animation channel I'm talking about is the Shook Kitty. A lot of you are probably familiar with some of their work, from memes on the rise of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles show, or you're more familiar with some of their other popular animations. But if I remember correctly, they did remove some of their videos one or two years ago, and I don't remember why. So when I went to Shook Kitty's channel, I wasn't really that surprised to see that the new videos that they started uploading on the channel was about cryptocurrency. In the video, we see this man named Steve welcoming us to his YouTube channel. And in the video, he was talking about crypto stuff. But the shocking part of this video isn't the incredibly bad ratio on likes and dislikes. Or the fact that the other one only got one comment. But that's actually close. The most shocking part of this video was the comment section. It's filled with bots. I know, I know. Some of you might say it's normal on a YouTube video to have bots, which is true. Almost all videos have one or two bots in the comments. But the first 10 comments of this video, 7 of them were bots. So who is the Steve guy? As much as I want to find out, that is sadly out of my area of expertise. But I did find this channel called Mountain Streets, and would you look at that, it's our boy Steve talking about crypto. So is this Steve's real channel? Did Mountain Street actually hack the Shook Kitty? Well, no, actually, because if we just scroll down, we can see that. Also, it's in their about page that Mountain Street is a Filipino YouTube channel that that primarily uploads lyric videos. Then they have a Facebook page where they still upload music related content I think. And I'm starting to think, did Steve buy the Mountain Street channel? Then also bought Shook Kitty? Again, we still don't know if it was hacked or sold. Since in the Mountain Street Facebook page, I don't think they really addressed it. That they were suddenly uploading crypto videos instead of lyric videos. So there's still that chance that they bought Shook Kitty. And in the comments, some actual people did also notice this and tried to contact Shook Kitty via Twitter. Until this day, they haven't responded or done anything. But someone also did bring up that they aren't active anymore. This situation is getting more and more strange. But I think the most annoying part of this is that Steve just posts the exact same video over and over. He reads the exact same script but puts on a different shirt and jacket, but also changes the thumbnail then uploads the same video 10 times. So let's move on to the possibility that the channel was actually hacked. This reminds me of that time that the Linus Tech Tips channel also got hacked was then streaming Elon Musk interviews and crypto scams. So out of all the nonsense I've said, I do hope that Shook Kitty's channel was actually hacked. Now hear me out. Since compared to it getting bought, they can most likely get the channel back if it was hacked, since that's what happened to Linus. So I do hope they get the channel back and that's about it. So I went to Shook Kitty's channel just to see if there's any changes, but I saw this. What the actual fuck? Genshin Impact free cheat. Okay, so this just makes my entire point useless.